Right, what is the fastest socks that no one is talking about? They're by this very odd brand called AeroCycling Gear. 419 followers on Instagram, not very big. They did follow me, had a look, checked out their socks, and was like, mm, what are these? New Aero Socks, I love a bit of Aero Socks. Got some Rule 28 Aero Socks, got some um, no pins over shoes. And um, Rompot have been riding them. I tried to get some socks today for, to send to me, but they said they were still testing them and maybe they'd get back to me. Um, but you may have seen that Lotto Sedal are wearing them. Astana are wearing them. Rompot look like they're wearing them. And um, we'll go into over to Victor Kempenarts and what did he wear for the hour record? And you'll see he's got his bond shoes, he's got his Vermax um, skin suit, and he's got these Ghana socks. And I was like, there's no way he's wearing cotton socks. So I had a little look into it. Look at his veins, fair play. And um, it's it's this company, Aerocycling Gear. It was an honor to help Victor s with his world record. Um, they developed new Aero socks um, and they are the fastest Aero socks in the world. Um, so yeah, pretty impressive. And you'll see in this photo, ooh, what's Van der Poel wearing? And we, we'll go over to another little picture of Van der Poel. Um, and he's wearing the same socks as well. Um, you see even Team Sky wearing some Aero socks. I'm not sure who makes Team Sky's Aero socks, but again here, Valens looks like he's wearing Aero socks as well. More and more people are wearing Aero socks. Um, you also see that Van der Poel he always wears a skin suit. That's the other thing I've noticed with him. Um, if you look whenever, whenever he wins, he's always wearing a skin suit. Like look here, you can see the skin suit there. Um, so yeah, it's pretty interesting. So we'll go over to their website. Um, we'll show Kim Panets as well. So you know, it's properly Aero, nice helmet, everything. And these socks, I mean, there's no way he's wearing cotton socks. So these are the Aero socks that they make. Um, 28 euros. Uh, I'm not sure what the difference between them is. There's the V1 and the V3, and the V1's more expensive. So I thought that would be, I think this might be their final one. Uh, there's no data about this, uh, just saying that they're in the wind tunnel. Uh, but yeah, this company, they, they work with a um, skin suit. Uh, sorry, skin suit, uh, speed skaters, I believe, um, and skeleton bobsleigh. Um, so you see the Netherlands, they do a lot of winter things, I think. Um, but yeah, the Aero socks is really what's interesting. Um, I'm not sure if they... Yeah, actually, this... Oh, sorry, this is just a different company's website. But yeah, Aero socks, that's where they are. Um, Aero as. So are they faster than Rule 28? I'd like to see a test. I'd like to see a test between Rule 28, no pins, these ones, apparently Castelli make Aero socks, and anyone else who does actually figure out which is the fastest, because I don't think I've ever seen a direct comparison between them all. Um, but yeah, it'll be interesting to see. So anyway, cheers. This is my quick update video. Um, cheers for watching. Uh, hope you did enjoy. If you've got any more questions about Aero socks or any other Aero things, then let me know, because I'm always interested in the old Aero socks. It just seems like a no-brainer, and when people don't ride them, um, it's just really dumb. So anyway, cheers for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.